weekend. It was great. How was yours? It was good. It was awesome. The office is busy and everyone is yeah, happy and talking when all of a sudden a big eyed, beautiful blonde walks into the office and leaves everyone speechless. She takes a look around and sees all eyes on her. Who's that? Hi everyone. Um, can anyone help me find Elena? Are you sure you're looking for Elena? If you're looking for the temp office, it's on the first floor, you know. Uh, no. I'm here to see Elena about a position here. Oh, well then. Her office is in that corner over there. Thanks. Wow, what a nice girl. Come in. Hi, Elena. My name's Tina. I'm here for the open position. Oh, yes, yes. Come on in. There is a few things we have to discuss. Yeah, no problem. Welcome to Tech Monster. We are so happy to have you. Uh, what I wanted to discuss with you is we do have another position that is opening up for a branch manager. And since your resume is quite impressive, is there any chance that you would be interested? Absolutely. That would be amazing. Okay. Now, I must warn you, I am tied between you and another colleague. It is a manager role, and I know you have no experience in management, but I still think with your skills in the field and your impressive academic achievements, you would be an asset to our company. What would a management role entail? Well, management roles entail different goals and responsibility. Firstly, a manager's responsibility is to maximize profits for the business. In other words, Tina, business is business and you have to do what is best for the company as long as, of course, it is ethically and legally correct. Do you understand that? Yes, of course. I am here to conduct business and make this place successful. In addition to that, if you do get this branch management position, you must establish ethical codes for yourself and for others. And we help with that by making all of our managers undergo ethical training. In this, we help shape your judgment and decision making in the business world and make sure everything is up to par. That sounds amazing. This all sounds easy for the moment, but I want you to know that you must be ready to be torn between two choices that are both arguably valid options, but you cannot be biased towards any one side. If at any time you are faced with something that is contrary to your beliefs, you must always do what you think is better for the company as a whole and put your beliefs aside. Are you prepared to handle that? Yes, I think I understand, and I know managing a branch is not easy, but I am more than willing to learn and train to become the best manager this company can have. That's amazing to hear. I'm sure you already know management is not a job that you can plan for, especially in this office. So I want you to be ready for any unpredictable challenges that arise. With all of this said, are you still interested in being a candidate for the branch manager job? It will be a change and maybe even hard at times, but I know I can do this and I am so happy you are considering me for the position. Okay, thank you so much for coming in. Um, we have a desk all set up for you. I will ask Lauren to show you the way. Tina walks out of Elena's office and sees Lauren waiting for her. Hi, I will be showing you to your office. I guess you were right after all. You were in the right place. <laughs> How did your meeting with Elena go? Oh, it went amazing. I am so happy. I am being considered as a candidate for the branch manager position. What? I mean, congrats. Anyways, this is your desk. I'll see you later. In a matter of seconds, the entire office knew that Tina was up for the promotion that could make her their boss.